Great. Today we are planting our topi plant. What is topi tambo, you might ask? Well, if you are from the Caribbean, you will know what topi tambo is. And here is our topi tambo plant. I gotta take it out of the container. So, I got this from a nursery in Florida. Someone asked the question, is it safe? And I believe the nurseries are supposed to do a lot of checking and make sure that they send you something that is legal. So we're good on that. And this is what it looks like before planting. It's supposed to plant it at or above the earth level. So I am going to probably put a little bit of soil underneath. I purchased some extra soil. And topi tumble plants like, um, they say a loose gravelly soil, which I don't have right now, but I'm gonna put, again, some of the purchased soil in, mix it with some of this other stuff, and hope for the best. It's a root crop, sort of like potatoes. It's too bad I didn't think of it sooner because then I would have put it over there in our potato bed. That is a very up and coming potato bed that is also turning into a volunteer greens bed. Because we are not sure where those greens are coming from, but I tasted that one in the corner and that's like wild arugula. You might say, how are you getting wild arugula in Long Beach? Well. I think I started it when I tried to grow arugula and I let it go to seed like about five years ago. And I noticed that there's another piece of wild arugula here and you can see the arugula shaped leaf and I actually took one of that plant off and tasted it and sure enough it's arugula. Anyway, so this, this is Topi Tambo. It goes into the soil right about now. And I think harvesting is around um, November or December. And then it'll go dormant. Hopefully I can use the same plant over and over again, but I am not sure if I can. So this is, this may be a one year operation or an annual planting. It's a little bit green around here. And over time I'm gonna kind of work my way, but I'm like a little, square foot at a time kind of person <laughs> anyway so I'm okay this is what a growing topi tambo plant looks like and this gives me some hope because I have in my ground and I'll show you when you see something that looks like this that's coming up but this was planted after my plant went in the ground and look at how much growth there is in this it's crazy so this is the thing that you plant but then coming out on all sides you'll see this and then the leaf looks like this this stem is very um, stiff but that is beautiful. And that is the Topi Tambo. Okay, progress on the Topi Tambo plant. Today is June 1st, 2021. And as you may know, if you've seen my previous videos, I planted a Topi Tambo plant. It's a really amazing root crop that is totally delicious and I haven't been able to figure out if it's been growing. Apparently this thing here is new and is going to become the expression of my Topi Tambo plant. That's going to be a leaf as it unfurls. Alright, here it is the big day! Topi Tambo Day! National Topi Tambo Day? Hmm, there's a thought. Hey, so I planted this, gosh, it was almost a year ago. It was 10 months, I think, when I took that video on planting my Topi Tambo plant. 
and here it is ready to be harvested how do I know it took a while for me to figure out how I would know when the Topi Tambo plant was ready to be harvested but I would say this looks ready this is like what happens when potato grows which is another root crop the potato crop will grow the uh, plant will die and then you can go in and dig up the potatoes underneath and here we go okay thinking again about this um, okay tugging on this I can see that I can't pull up the whole plant because it just comes off but okay maybe that's something we start by starting with where the plant is because I know that I'll find something there because I've been digging around here thinking like I'll start with the end of the roots and nothing's happening there's so, digging 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 not finding any topi tambo yet this is a little unsettling What down is it? Ugh. I have this. Let me take so I don't have to get my hands so dirty. Oh, where is the Toby Tambo? Hmm. It's a rock. Huh. No Toby Tambo? Hmm. Okay, my hand so that I can just... This is my one-year science project. <laughs> Multi-year? Hang on. Oh, what's this? Oh, what happened there? I don't know what's going on in here. I think... Oh, what is that? It looks like almost like ginger. I'm not sure what I am looking at. This is not quite what I expected. I'm going to dig further to see, because I expected that there would be little nodules that came out, kind of like potatoes. But maybe these are the Toby Tambo? I don't really know. This is what happens when you experience something in childhood, and then years later, you try to make it happen. See what happened to this Toby Tambo part? I might have to post this to some of my trendy friends to see if they can help me figure out where the Toby Tambo is. Where is the Toby Tambo? It could just be that my soil is way too hard for it to grow. So now this is me mixing it up so the next time I plant it, it will be better. Now I'm gonna have to try to find the big thing because there was a big thing that I planted and I think I planted it over there. So I'm gonna go digging for it.